Hey, welcome back. So a lot has happened since last time we talked. As you can see, I got a new truck. Well, it's a really old truck. But what happened was I got a really good deal on a really old truck. So I sold my truck and bought this. And that has expanded our coffers quite a bit. Got a decent amount of money now. We're up to 32000 because my truck was fairly expensive. Uh, I also just had them drop off this new winch this is for logging with the tractor so we can drag logs around now i know i said i didn't want to cut down a lot of these trees but i changed my mind a little bit as you can see the path that we made has dried out and i was able to get the litter off of it so there's not all the sticks and things that were there quite as much but Back to the trees. I've decided I want a second grass field. So I went ahead and marked out a whole bunch of trees on this side that I'm going to cut down. And we're going to make a grass field over here. It'll still leave most of the trees that way and everything that side of the field. So we're just going to kind of duplicate that field between here and the creek. So I guess we'll go ahead and start cutting down trees. And then I think I'm going to pull them out there to cut them up and load them instead of trying to do it here in the bushes. So let's get to that. Okay, I think that was all the trees I had marked to cut down. The ones over here, yeah, I marked those to save. I had marked to cut down and then realized that we were about even with that field. So you can see the area that's going to be our new field. It's this big open spot now. So I'll go and stick the winch on the back of the tractor. We'll start winching them over. I think I'm going to drag them all over into this field so that it's much easier to work on them. This winch seems to work okay with a tractor this size from what I can tell. We'll find out here in a second. Just hook up to it. Hook it up. Drive this right over. We're probably going to have to go one one tree at a time, I'm thinking, because they are big trees and it's a small tractor. But we can park this right here. Grab our winch cable. Hook it up to our first tree. Let's see. Will that winch it up? Oh, see it's dragging our tractor already. But if we drive the tractor, we might be able to drag it. Are you stuck on something? Or are you just being... Mm, this one might actually just be stuck. Yeah. What if we go like this? Take off the end. Oh, 
and cutting it undid our winch cable. Let's try that again. Do to do some of these tallest trees we may need to cut in half. Let's see, are you gonna come or not? Oh, here it comes. Here it comes. We got it on stuck. Make sure we don't catch it on that tree. And I winch that in at all. Oh, no, nope, it's just going to pull the tractor. Okay, come on. Give it a good yank. Come on, old girl. You got this. Let's go. Drag that log. We're getting there. Get it out here in the sun so it'll be easy to see. Come on. Come on, you can do it. Be better if I had tracks or studded tires or something. Get a little grip. Or even a bit of a weight on the tractor. Give it a little more mass. Come on, just a little more. All the way out in the sun. You can do it. We're almost there. All right, I guess we'll call that good. Let's unhook that, and then we'll uh, get the rest. So I'll I'll get all these dragged over. Hopefully, not that long. If they're that big again, I'll probably cut it in half and do it in two, just so that uh, it doesn't take nearly as much messing around with. This thing does not go very fast in reverse. That's for sure. Right, there's the edge of the trees so if we find trees they're going to be in here yeah there's trees all right so i'll get these hooked up get them dragged over and then i'll get back with you
Well, that's all the wood dragged over here. So that's good. Uh, we're not going to cut it up and sell it right now. What I think I'm going to do is cut it and stack it somewhere. And then uh, sell it at a later date. But I do want to check. If I were to cut one of the thickest logs at two and a half meters. Can I pick that up? I can. I think the two and a half meters will fill this trailer a little bit better. Yeah, that seems to be pretty much exactly the right size for the trailer. Two and a half meters. So, I will probably cut and stack these later. Maybe I'll even make a stack back here. Stack them all up and then we can sell them as we want to.